Sitting at the corner of Wabash and Michigan Street, this house was designed by architect Frank Schlotter and was built by the contractors Griesbacher and Doobie. Jacob Fisher, the president of the Evansville Stove Works, was born in Germany in 1848. He immigrated to America as a young man. He died in this house on July 27, 1917, due to complications from some mysterious disease. In 1917, Fisher's house was remodeled to a more modern style. The facade of the house was changed greatly during the renovation. The front porch was incorporated into the house, and the entire facade was covered with a large gable front roof. This is a three-story red brick building with a large porch at the front of the house. Several columns support the portico that shelters the front porch. Two tall rectangular windows dominate the first floor of the facade, along with a French door topped with a rectangular transom. The second floor contains a large bay window. A pair of windows are located on the third floor in the gable of the house. The north side of the house has two bay-styled windows capped with a gable. A small covered porch on the side contains two griffin statues. The house also has three ornate chimneys. The south side of the house contains an enclosed porch with five two-by-two two rectangular windows. Behind the home is the old carriage house that has brickwork matching the house. It has a corbelled parapet at the top and segmented and round arched windows. It is now used as a garage for the home with an apartment upstairs. The Jacob Fisher House still remains as one of North Wabash's most eye-appealing homes.